Hey, what's up? It's Brizzo, and this is Fear Extreme Difficulty Walkthrough Interval 9 Incursion Bypass Part 2. So, there was a. There's two more of these big ass power things down here. But, uh, this second one can't get activated because there's a, a crate in the way. And you have to move the crate first. So the crate control is actually up up here. Says here Hama was eight years old when Origin started up. They used a little girl. No wonder they're so fucking anxious to keep a lid on this mess. Somebody's gonna burn for this. That's why our receipt hasn't returned my call. He's probably on a plane to Jamaica. Yeah, these people are kind of fucked up. So, go back and activate that power thingy my baba. Now that room that was back here that you couldn't go through is now open. So head on through and there's a couple UAVs to deal with over here. Uh, I actually recommend using the lean. I try not to lean because the d-pad sucks. I said that in an earlier video but against these guys it's actually really effective. But it, it, It's kind of like this uh, weird claw with your hand you have to make using your thumb on the d-pad and then like your left index finger on the left stick to move and then clicking in with the right stick with your right thumb and then using your right index finger to move. See, I switched to the remote bombs because the fucking 360 d-pad is a piece of shit. Alright, so we just walked past the last one that was supposed to go, and in order to get through through to there, you have to uh, squeeze through this little hole area where these barrels, who the hell knows what they even do, are going down, and there just so happens to conveniently be a little gap big enough for you to fit through. So open that, and then head into this office over here, after you pick up the booster. And I believe it is the last voicemail in the game. Um... I could be wrong. I ended up heading out back because something seemed wrong and there's a second switch but it's not here. It's it's after that office with the voicemail. So, listen to it. You have two new messages. First message from Genevieve Aristide. Harlan, it's Genevieve. Listen, I understand your feelings, I really do. But this is 
no time for sentimentality. If origin is uncovered, every single one of us will burn for it. It's time we buried the dead, don't you think? Next message from Genevieve Aristide. Harlan, it's me again. If you want an apology, then I apologize. I was wrong. You were right. In any case, I want to be sympathetic, but the situation is urgent. I'm sending Mapes to take care of things since you seem reluctant to do what needs to be done. I hope you can find it in yourself to assist him. End of messages. Damn, these people are messed up. So, uh, you'll notice my health is now at 199 after picking up every health booster, but... Uh, I think there's one more, I'm not really sure, I recorded this a few days ago. This is actually the first time I recorded such a large chunk of gameplay before doing my voiceover. Normally I do a level, edit it, voice it, upload it before I do the next one, but, uh... I knocked all this out on... Monday, and today is Thursday. So, there's a couple replicas in here. I'm actually shooting at the guy in the back instead of the guy that's standing right next to me, which was pretty stupid. Luckily, they didn't do too much damage. And, uh, so head on through. Uh, you get a a fettle sighting. There's a couple UAVs left to deal with and then head on into the facility. And I'll meet back up with you there. Contact from here on. Be careful of this wave guy. Gun only knows 